welcome to this user manual for the Brace ID Shoulder Abduction Pillow. This brace is indicated in cases of rotator cuff repairs, capsular shifts, bank art repairs and other shoulder instabilities. The correct sling size should be determined preoperatively. Keep the elbow in a 90 degree angle and support the arm correctly. Align the cushion at waist level on the injured side. Bring the waist strap around the patient's back and close it with the click closure system at the front of the pillow, near the hand. Adjust strap length and trim it as necessary for a correct fit. Place the patient's forearm into the sling with the elbow as far back as possible in the sling. Attach the thumb strap on the sling between thumb and index finger at the open side of the sling. Reach behind your body with your free arm to catch the other end of the shoulder strap and put your arm through it. This motion is quite similar to putting on a backpack. The green strap should move over the unaffected arm and rest on top of the shoulder. The black strap goes underneath the arm. Please note that for a left side application, the position of the straps is reversed. Check the length of all straps for an optimal stabilization of the injured shoulder. When necessary, remove the Y tabs on each strap end and trim these when required. Reposition the Y tabs and secure all straps. Secure the forearm strap to the sling and cushion. Check the position of the O-rings on the front and back side. These should be positioned in such a way that the patient doesn't experience any discomfort. Place the green ball on the cushion, allowing the patient to rest his or her hand on it, and more importantly, to perform squeeze exercises with hand and fingers. When rehab exercises have to be done, just open the outside snap closure on the sling. Remove forearm strap and thumb loop. The arm can be taken out or elbow can be moved. The shoulder abduction device can also be used without the pillow in a later phase of the rehab. In this case, remove the waist strap from the cushion and the buckle and thread this strap through the small D-rings attached on the front and back side of the sling. Secure the strap around the patient's waist with the Y-tab hook closure system and trim it when required. Thanks for watching.